Gibble Community Day and it is probably the most exciting Community Days this year. Now you're going to want to Mega Evolve Ampharos, Charizard X, or Altaria in order to get one more candy for Gibble. So I'm going to do that. I set Altaria as my buddy. So let's get to Altaria. It's my perfect, I have two perfect Altarias, but this is the one I'm going to evolve, Mega Evolve, and this is the first time I'm Mega Evolving it. Go. There it goes, and it looks like a giant cloud. There it is. It's got so much fluff. There it is, first Mega Altaria, and it's as my buddy, and luckily with flying types, they're going to be out of the way of like spawns so they're not walking on the ground and uh, also this community day will help me with my dragon badge because I just have a little bit more to get to platinum and then you know I need gibble candy the XL candy I hope I can get some more XL candy I hope I can get a perfect because I don't have a perfect not only that, but I only have one shiny Gibble, and I would like a couple more. And the shiny for Mega Garchomp is pink. And Skittles is making noise in the background. Sorry about that. But, um, Community Day starts in a little bit. I went outside to spin a poke stop, but it's getting pretty hot. It's going to be 90 degrees today. So, I'm going to go out for a little bit outside. But mostly I'm going to be inside. So I'll check back with you guys in a little bit and see if we can find a shiny Gibble. It is 11 o'clock and I am loading into Pokemon Current. And uh, Skittles is with me. Come here, Skittles. No, you just want to sit there. Okay. And uh, let's see the spawns come in. See if any of them are shiny. And I did the research. Let's see. Ooh, there's our first Gibble. It's right here. Not shiny, but I am going to pine up it. Whoa, it's over a thousand. I'm going to definitely Ultra Ball that. You get free Ultra Balls in the shop, too. And I heard the professor. Alright, let's see what the professor has to say. Discorded Soul, excellent timing. I just made a tremendously exciting discovery. Earlier today, I was exploring a nearby cave to collect some stamp samples when I noticed a peculiar warmth along one of the walls. Suddenly, something jumped out and tried to bite me. I quickly realized I had stumbled upon a nest of Gibble, the land shark Pokemon. Gibble is known to react to anything that moves, so sometimes it leaps out and chomps passerbys. I know it just wanted a nibble, but that's a nibble too much in my book. Anyway, it's not every day you run into a gaggle of a gibble. Do you think you could head out and do some research on their appearance here? Well, I'm not going to head out because it's way too hot, but uh, I'll put on an incense and sit here. So I have to power Pokemon ten times, catch fifteen gibble, and make five nice throws. So I'll get back to you guys when I get through those steps. Alright, I am headed out now. No shiny gibbles yet, but hopefully I'll get one there. So, yeah. You'll see me at the park next. Well, right as I was leaving, I got a shiny! And, uh, let's see the sparkles again. There it is. And this is gonna be my second shiny gibble. So let's use a golden raz. I always use a golden raz and pokeball my shinies. There we go. First shiny gibble of the day. Hopefully that means good luck as well. And uh, yeah, let's see if it's any good. Let's see. Two star, not bad. So I'm gonna head to the park now. Alrighty guys, I'm at Eldridge and there's a bunch of Gibble right here. I already got like four or five shinies. So let's just check all these. Oh, oh, there it is. It was glitching out a little bit. Not shiny. Not shiny. Nope, not shiny. I hope I can get either a hundo or a shundo. That would be nice. 
not shiny, they're all on top of each other. Uh, not shiny. Let's see. And not shiny. But I'm gonna keep checking, you know. It's uh, quite hot out today, like I said. But, um, you know, all the gibbles are weather boosted too, which is nice. And I'm just gonna walk around and I'll let you guys know when I get a shiny. I just got a shiny. Alright, let's golden razz it. Oops, not pineapple. No, no, no. And. Oh, come on. Let me catch you, Gibble. There we go. Alright. There we go. I'm gonna check the other ones around here really fast, too. Let's see. Nope. 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 And... Nope. I'm making sure to pine up each one, too, so I can get XL candy as well. So, yeah, gonna check in with you guys when I get another one. Alrighty guys, I finished part one of what the professor wants. Just a nibble, that's what it's called. So let's see if any of these are good. Let's see. Nope, not a shiny, but it is 445. I think 447 is perfect, I believe. Alright. See if it's any good. Let's see. No, it's not good. And let's claim the other stuff. Two thousand dust, one incense, and a mysterious Pokemon. It's gonna be Gibble. Nope, not shiny. Let's see. Let's check what's next. Right. Welcome back, trainer. While you were out tracking down the land shark Pokemon, I took a closer look at the cave I was telling you about earlier. I was reminded of an interesting tidbit about Gibble. It nests inside small horizontal holes in cave walls warmed by geothermal heat. Gibble seems to love warm places, and that cave certainly fits the bill. We've learned a lot about this dragon and ground type Pokemon, but there's always more to discover. When you're ready, how about you try evolving your Gibble into Gibbite? Alright, so I'm gonna have to do that, transfer 10 Pokemon, and evolve 3 Gibbles. So I'm gonna work on that next. So I was just taking a photo of Gibble, and uh, I got a shiny with the photo bomb. There it is. So I'm going to Golden Raz it as per usual, and catch it. So this one's from the photobomb, so if you take pictures of Gibble, you have up to five photobombs. Alright, come on. Come on, catch him. There it is. There we go. There it is. Shiny Gibble. Are you any good? Please be good. Nope, not very good. Alright, I'm going to check this one over here. Oops, that's not a Gibble, that's a Pokestop. Oh, uh, if I can reach it. Oh, uh, I'll check this one. Not shiny. Alrighty guys, I'm back home. I've actually been home for a little bit. I got a few shinies, but uh, I'm gonna finish what the professor has for this task. gonna get earth power which makes Garchomp the number one ground type attacker and then I'll figure out which shiny Gibble I want to evolve. Alrighty I found the ones I wanted to evolve so let me go to them. This one I'm going to evolve I think. Is it this one? Yeah. 
I'm gonna evolve... Actually, no. I only need to evolve two. So I'm gonna evolve this one and this one. This one I'm gonna evolve all the way. So let's just evolve to this one now. I like the color of shiny Gabite, but shiny Garchomp, it's not very good, but shiny Mega Garchomp looks amazing. Like I said earlier, it is pink. Alright, so there is shiny Gabite. It's very uh, blue. It's pretty. And then let's go to this one, and then we're going to evolve it one more time. There we go. It looks so cool when it's Gabite and Gibble, but Garchomp doesn't look very good. There it is. Sweet. Ta-da! Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.